Yo, what is up guys? So for today, we're going to be talking about Destiny 2. Now specifically, we're going to be talking about the interview that Luke Smith had not too long ago with Polygon. And we're going to, about, we're going to talk about something that he said in his uh, interview that kind of bugs me. And uh, the whole thing bugged me. Let's not get let, let's not get it twisted. I've literally redone this video like five times because it just devolves me into talking the maddest shit. And I don't want to do that. So let's talk about class jealousy real quick. So his idea of class jealousy is that idea that you might look at an allied hunter and feel jealous that you can't use golden gun on the boss just as they look at your titan wishing they could use ward of dawn. That's the goal for, for Luke Smith, to give players a reason to play each class and help make Hunters, Titans, and Warlocks feel all special for, their, for playing their chosen class. So, <laughs> it's funny that he says this because I didn't have class jealousy in Destiny 1. And I specifically bring Destiny 1 because that's when the... That's when the class identity was at its strongest. So back in Destiny 1, if you guys don't know, we didn't have three supers. And when I say that, I mean we didn't have the subclass supers. So for those of you that don't know, Hunters did not have a Void super. Titans did not have a Solar super. And Warlocks did not have a Arc super. Which meant we only had Golden Gun and one called blade dancer titans had bubble just bubble if i remember correctly and the slam the arc slam warlocks only had a solar super that basically when you died you can resurrect yourself and they had the the void bomb the nova bomb obviously with the trees that destiny one had we can customize it a little bit here and there obviously there's like really just two or three viable options so realistically we did have three supers almost or two really so or two builds and i don't think luke smith remembers that in destiny one there was no class jealousy in a positive way it was more of a negative way it was not like how he's saying where it's a, that idea that you might look to an allied hunter and feel jealous that you can't use a golden gun it was never like that because they didn't feel jealous that they couldn't use a golden gun because a golden gun by itself was not the greatest you had to be using celestial nighthawk with it to make it viable two warlocks and titans were already powerful without having anything on them Bubble was already stupid powerful and Warlocks with their self res was already powerful enough so they did not need an exotic and especially how hard it was to get exotics back in Destiny 1. Some hunters didn't even see Celestial Nighthawk unless Zer was selling it. So when he talks about Clash Jealousy, I remember Destiny 1 and how I was annoyed and angry that I basically had to push my hunter into everyone's face and say, I'm taking my hunter, I don't care what you say. And then I would get kicked because they were looking for a Titan or a Warlock. Was Celestial bad? No, by no means. If I had Celestial, people would generally be like, well, I guess I'll, well, fuck it. We have enough Warlocks and Titans that it shouldn't be a problem. That was the thing. It was never a, oh, okay, that's cool. Yeah, you'll be, you'll be good. No, it was always, damn. Your hunter fuck well i guess we can make it work dude hunters really needed to work that extra more to not be a hindrance i remember back in destiny one my whole spiel was that i was the medic i would res everyone if everyone died i was using i wasn't even using celestial i was literally using top tree arc or not i'm sorry not top tree arc we were i was using arc with an invis build I was literally always going invisible so that way when someone died I would always be the first one to heal them because that was the best I could do because I didn't have Celestial Nighthawk. So I was literally trying to be useful and to some people it's just like I mean dude we can do that already we can bubble on people we can self res and it's the most annoying thing like y'all don't remember those days of hunters literally 
having to push their hunter into people's faces to do raids and shit. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm not saying hunters were useless. It's just that without Celestial, it was hard to get picked up on a raid. So that's what I remember when I think of class jealousy. I remember of me just being so angry that I was a hunter main. But I liked the armor for my hunter so much that I just had to persevere. And now that I remember the day when we got the void subclass and we found out what it did. And I was so fucking happy because at that point I could be useful. I'm useful now. And a lot of people don't remember that. A lot of people don't remember the sigh of relief that hunters had that we finally had a, a super that we could be useful in. People weren't going to be like, oh, you're a hunter. Gross. Now it was like, oh, you're a hunter. All right. Use tether. Oh, okay, cool. No, no one remembers that. And this whole class jealousy thing gives me bad vibes about that. Because if you go back to hunters just being damaged, with maybe Tether being our only one that's really viable for PvE, then it's gonna be annoying. You think you think you hate being a well warlock or a bubble titan now? If these changes go into play, you're always gonna be using the same build, the same subclass, the same insert something here. Because that's what it is. It really is that that simple. And I think I think Destiny shines better when everyone can do each other's job. When it's like, oh, we don't have a bubble, that's fine. We can do this instead, or we can do that instead. Build diversity is great, and this is gonna hurt people a lot more than it's gonna help. All just to have this identity of each class when in realistically just make the armor cool as hell. There's your identity. Why do you run Titan? Oh, because I like how they look. I like the fact that they look like actual fucking tanks. Okay, what about you? Why do you like the Warlocks? Oh, because I like that they have fucking cool space magic. Also, because they look like fucking Warlocks. Dude looks like fucking Gandalf. Okay, what do you, what do you like about the Hunter? Because he looks like a fucking rogue, bro. He literally looks like he's killing people in the fucking shadows. That's the identity, not, oh, because I can slam really hard for one time use only. That was, that was Titans in Destiny 1. Titans didn't have a roaming super. Yeah, yeah. Titans did not have a roaming super. Warlocks technically had a roaming super, technically. So when I say technically, they had Nova Bomb and then they had self res self res there was a... A note on it that you could actually pop it and you got your abilities really fast that was it hunters were the only ones that had an actual uh duration based super so it was uh blade dancer and people hated blade dancer rightfully so it was really stupid but that was that was the class identity yeah sure we sucked in pve because we didn't have any cool shit like you guys did but we destroyed in pve or pvp dog we were destroying it that's why a lot of people still play hunters because they were most likely just uh, i played i played it in destiny one so i played in destiny two so that's what i remember when i think about class identity and class jealousy is destiny destiny one pre uh taken king and i don't want to go back to that i really don't want to go back to that especially when we have so many builds so many diverse options to go back to that i would just i would hate it but let me know your thoughts in the comments below if you guys want to follow me on my social media outlets linked in the description below let me know what you guys think about it personally like i said i i love the class diversity i think if each class could do each other's jobs that would be amazing sure a lot of people would be like oh but that defeats the purpose of using either or class not really like at that point just what do you like to look at or like aesthetically what do you like not only that but maybe you like the warlocks uh well more than the titans bubble or if hunters had one do you or, like maybe you like that one more personally i would love it if hunters got like let's say they threw two knives at the floor or not two knives they threw like enough knives that it made a shape that shape became smoke and that smoke nullified every damage that you take in it and also gave you either a damage buff or a damage debuff to the boss itself i don't know i think that would be great and it would alleviate a lot of 
annoyances that like Titans or Warlocks may have because they have to run that specific thing all the time. I think that's great. So that's just me though. I would love to see that, but I understand why people maybe not would not like to see that. So yeah, be safe guys. You know what's happening though, and I'll see you guys later.